Hey, it's Lise Wheel. Can you believe it's the end of June? And here we have Heart of Ice. You've got to go check it out. And I've got to tell you about something really special that happened. Remember that Girlfriends Only contest for you and two friends to come to New York? Well, we have a winner, Lori Hyden. And this is what she said when she was asked, what have you and your friends done to make a difference in your world? Um, this really touched my heart. My friends and I work daily with children and parents who struggle with disruptive disorders. Most of the children have been diagnosed with autism spectrum disorder. While most of the children exhibit explosive behaviors, if it weren't for my friends' daily involvement with them individually and their families, these children would ultimately be placed in a setting outside their home. Um, she goes on to say, we all read as an escape and being able to meet Lisa in New York would actually refresh and revitalize us, revitalize us, making a difference in our lives. We hope to make a difference when we see children able to be mainstreamed in the regular school setting and succeed. We know we have. So I really look forward to visiting with Lori and two friends here. I think they're coming out in October to New York and I can't wait to welcome them here. Um, I just wanted to give you a little heads up on some other reading I'm doing this summer. Of course, I've read Heart of Ice and all of you have. A um, couple other really interesting books I want to look at this summer on my beach read, The Ultimate Gift. Um, with uh, It just it looks fascinating to me. It's now a, a, a major motion picture, but I always like to read my books before I see them on the big screen. So, so take a look at that. Uh, Forward by Jim Stovall. Um, it looks really, really terrific. And uh, it's by Renee Gutterwid Gutteridge. And then this looks like a fine kind of thriller to me, a fun one. The Last Thing I Remember by David Claveman. Andrew Claveman, I'm sorry, by Andrew Claveman. I'm taking this with me on any vacation I have this summer. So it's June. It's a happy summer to everybody. Happy graduation to everybody. And I got no, I have two of my own, a graduate from high school and eighth grade. So happy graduation, everybody. Go out and read Heart of Ice and enjoy your time at the beach.